Welcome back to another TechCore Duo video. And for today, I've got a quick solution on how to delete uh, an application completely. Uh, most of the time when you delete an app uh, from your applications folder, uh, you can just pretty much just pull it out from here and drag it right to the trash can and that'll delete it. But uh, other times when you delete an app, there are preference files and plists that are still left behind, which can cause which can cause uh, odd things to happen if you ever re-download the app, and it can potentially just make the app uh, not work as expected. Uh, and there's actually a solution for that that's free. I'm going to show you what that is right now. Uh, let's open up a web browser, and we can do a Google search. It is called App Cleaner Mac. There we go. And it is from Free Macsoft. And we'll click on here for the latest version. Just let it download. All right, download is complete. I'm going to drag it to the desktop. Double click. Awesome, now that it's unzipped, I'm going to drag it over to my applications folder and get rid of that zip file. Awesome. All right, so what I'm going to do is actually uh, take back this Android file transfer that I deleted earlier. I'm going to put it back inside of my applications folder just so that you can see what App Cleaner actually does. Uh, so let's run it for the first time. Uh, we're going to get a warning saying it's downloaded from the internet. We're going to agree to that. Awesome. And then we're going to take Android file transfer and drag it over to the app. And as you can see, aside from just deleting the application from the application folder, it also deletes items from the user library and caches and preferences from the user library. And these kind of items not only take up space on the hard drive, but can also uh, make the app work oddly or malfunction if you're ever needing to download it um, again or reinstall it for whatever reason. So what we'll do is hit remove and get rid of that. And I'm just going to go down the list and see if there's anything else that I might not need here that we can get rid of. Uh, let's get rid of this Dill client here. All right, and it looks like it pulled some other stuff from application support. We'll hit remove, type in our password, and OK. There we go. That is that is the most uh, efficient way to delete a, an app. And some other uses for this can be if an app isn't working right uh, and you want to delete it and reinstall it, this is the best way to do it because it'll take all the preference files and caches that might be causing it to not behave the way you're expecting it to and sort of give it a nice uh, fresh start. Uh, that's all for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you join us back next time.